Hey, good morning. This is Bob. Day 349. Now, I'm crooked. <laughs> it's, I, I've got this. I'm going to show you where I, where I have the camera set up. Oops. I have the camera set up. There's a big old boulder right here. There's a whole beautiful wonder dog. So it's crooked. That's the reason why I'm putting it right here. Now, I can hold it. Now, see those trees over there? That's where Annie's is staying right now. That's where he lives. <clears throat> and he's sleeping right now. So I didn't... I usually set up my... I usually set up my camera right on his little bench right here, but he's sleeping and I don't want to wake him up. Today is like far <clears throat> the coldest day of the year. It's freezing. Well, here's the rest of the country. All warm. People in Buffalo like 71 degrees and stuff like that. Oops, I keep dropping the camera. Hope you came later. Okay, so yeah, so today, today I woke up and my thought process was, well, I, every morning I wake up in the morning and I... I get quiet. I get, I get real quiet, and I, and I I allow I allow things to come to me. Sometimes, I mean, I, I open myself up to, to God. You know, I'm I'm not I'm saying that I, have, that I have anything special, any special powers or anything like that. But I just get quiet. And I just allow things to come to me. And I get, I sometimes I get messages for people, and and I had two messages today, and I shared them with uh, with people. Sometimes it happens. And I just feel like, okay, there's something that I need to, to let them know, to tell them. Like I said, again, I'm not saying that I have any special powers, because I don't. It's just, just, it's just feelings. I'm tuning in more into my feelings. And today, the, the thought that I had besides that was, talk about forgiveness. Talk about forgiveness. So I put a couple, couple memes up there on my Facebook wall about forgiveness. And it's so important. It's so important that we learn how to forgive ourselves. You know, we, we, we forgive others. Well, if you don't forgive others, you should. You should, always, you should always forgive people, no matter what happened. You know, if it's something that's real recent, maybe you need to deal with it. But don't hold any anger inside of you towards other people. Just don't do that. Don't go there. Let it go. You know, it was said, it was, there was a famous quote by somebody who said that, you know, if you, if you, by being angry at somebody, by holding it in, it's, it's like drinking poison and expecting them to get sick. They're not, you know, so if you hold resentment towards somebody for something, they're moving on with their life, and you're sitting there, and you're letting this, these acids destroy your body and your mind. Let it go. Don't, don't be angry towards anybody. I can honestly say I have no anger in my heart towards anybody. Nobody. Zero. Zippo. I'm totally, totally at peace with, with myself. And you also have to do the same thing to yourself. You have to forgive yourself. Now, one of the things we have a, our 90-day wealth building plus mastermind, one of our daily activities is to forgive yourself. Every single day we forgive ourselves for maybe we didn't do the right things yesterday. It might not be anything bad, but maybe we just say, oh, man, I always mess up. I, I, I just, I never do this. Stop saying bad things to yourself. Stop doing it. Forgive yourself. You're freaking awesome. You're amazing. You really are, but you have to you have to forgive yourself first. You have to get to that place where you wipe the slate clean. You got to wipe the slate clean and start over. And if you have resentment towards yourself or anybody else, but especially towards yourself, you have to let it go. You have to let it go because it's like it's like having a closet full of clothes. If you got a bunch of old bunch of clothes in there. There's no room for anything new. You have to clean it out. Nature abhors a vacuum. You got to get rid of the old crap. What if, you're in, what if you're in a really bad relationship? And I'm not telling you to get rid of your relationship, but what if you're, but what if you're in an abusive relationship where you know, you're being treated like crap all the time? People are saying not, not empowering things to you. You've got to get rid of that stuff. You've got to open yourself up and allow goodness. You've got to allow love to come in, into, your, into your life, into your heart. Now, here's um, something that I, I, I do this morning. I did this about, about 10 times. Here comes a couple friends of mine is to allow yourself to like a short little breathing meditation where you close your eyes and you breathe in love and gratitude breathe it in hold it in for about this how long however long you can hold it in for and then breathe out forgiveness breathe in love gratitude and then breathe out forgiveness for even longer breathe out breathe out forgiveness and just allow it to let go just let go allow yourself to let because you're worth it you're amazing you're awesome okay now tonight i want to share with we have and our team we have an amazing team if you want information about joining us in our team i like to share things that are going to help you mentally emotionally make you happier 
healthier, better relationships, more money, the deeper spiritual connection. That's, that's what my, my goal is for everybody that joins our team. We're having a webinar tonight. Jackson Kelly is putting it on. He's an amazing guy. You can go to, you can send me a message on Facebook or go to gogreengetpaid.com slash live. I think that's I think that's what it is. But hit me up on Facebook and I'll be happy to let you know what that is. Good morning, guys. Just good walk morning. by and don't, don't say good morning or anything like that. I'm, I'm doing I'm doing my morning gratitude video. You're talking to the rock. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to part the sea. I'm trying to get water to come out of the rock. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good one. Okay, Bob. All righty. So that's so so check that out tonight. But anyway, just remember that you're freaking awesome. You have to forgive yourself, okay? So forgive yourself, forgive other people, but forgive yourself. All right. So I'll see you tomorrow on day 350. Whoa, we're getting real close to the end of the year. Thank you. I love you, and I'm grateful for you. And who are you grateful for today? Bye-bye.